This is Die Sporting Network. What, what, what? We begin with the starting five for the model Eagle. We begin at guard, the five foot ten inch senior, number two, Joshua Wozner. Since December 19th, we lost to Maris. We've seen them, in my case, via the DMV Vision and Elite matchup. We had them against Oxford there at the Sipwell Friends Classic. They was defeated there in the third place game. And they've only lost them four games since. They have rolled since then and also is the defending Class A champion here on the boys' side. And they was able to win last week in the PCSA Class A Championship, defeating the C School here at BC. The model school. And they, speaking of C to BC, defeated them to get here 59 53 in the semifinals at Georgetown. 
And for this game, since the model school, special school, secondary school for the deaf, please, you need to use the CC button here on YouTube to check them out. Coach is out starting off here for the Panthers. They swing it to three. Off the bounce, jump burn. That one misses for Williams. Offensive rebound. Walsner. Jump ball. MSSD. Gets it back. Eagles had a record of 22 and 6. Looked well during the season, talking to their coaching staff for the game and said all their players are really good, but Medina number one, Sander number 10. Watch out for in this one today. Big City. Back over to Jackson. Jackson inside. Two points to score off. For the Panthers. Jackson. Panthers. Last year was a lower seed to get to this game and win. This year they're the favorite. Looking good so far. Like I said, they have not lost in about three months. That one spins in. And it's in. Bippins with the spin it in move and it ties this game at two. Swings it back here to Jackson. Dupree, pull up. That one hits off the back, no good. Offensive rebound there to Gray. He got it taken away. Back comes the model school. And that one's picked off from off of Weddle. Cutting, lane, there it goes to the Con Williams. Talked to Coach Miller before the contest, and they need a good game out of Williams, and so far, so good. Yeah, for the junior. That's a three. It's off the bat, no good for Washington. The rebound there over the gray. They swing it now back over to the three. That's a three. Hits it at Williams. 7 2 lead for the kid for DC. Panthers in there on Grave. Back door, but it got closed up. On Kittner. We swing it back again. Over. Wide open three. Over three. Early 10 2 lead here for the Panthers. Rolling here so far. Off the screen. Swings, that's a three. Well, no good. Rebound here to Jackson. He steps back. He pulls up from deep. And he hits. The three balls driving like water here at the Smith Center. That's a 13 2 game. A three. Got it. Big City again. To the ten, out of bounds. Ball. Back to the mile school. That's a three. Off the back, no good. Nice save there. You good to get it back. Out of bounds. Model school gets it back. Turnover. Point lead 
here for the defending Class A champion, Kip. Try! Say it was tapped by Eagles. Claire. Eagles keep possession here. 343 left here in the first. Lionel. Jumper. Got it. Lippins with the long distance two. Oh, put on the deck. Inside. Off the glass, and it was too strong there. The ball back to the model school. Fakes it. Looking to shoot that three. The pull back. Pick City. Dupree. Up the court. Layup goes, and for Williams. Fifteen to seven. Swain. That's a three. No good. Let's throw the rebound, and he gives it over to Jackson. Nice disc. Jumper. Oh, Clint's in and out for McLean. 15 7 late. Inside. That's right. hits there for the Eagles. They're down 15 to 9. On my six. Panthers have done well this year, like I said. They, as that was picked off. Long pass. Whoa. Running on the outside there of 22nd Street here in George Washington. <laughs> 15 to 9 game. City, nice way to get in the passing lane. Swings it. Nice pass work, but a walk. Panthers will get it back with 149 left here in the quarter. Thing here. Picks, no! No! No, they call a foul against. Kept there. Foul hit number five. Savion Jackson. That's his first team set. Side of Gonzaga here today. Everybody sees them will be completed. Gonzaga's going to the Up Harmer Act tournament. And that one skips out of here. Eagles basketball. We have St. John's and Setwell well, Friend Girls. That's coming up here on DSN after this Class A boys matchup. We're switching on to the Class Double A. What a game. Expect that one to be on the girls' side. What a steal! 
Back the other way. Couldn't get the finish with Jackson. Nice defense. Good by Deans. Have to let that one get away. I'll tell you the Panthers though, they play some great ball. This action, well, what's, what's happening for you? Know, well, turned it up. Time of two. Pass. Three. That one tipped and miss. Tap back. Inside. Up and in. How about Beans working it on the baseline? Shot clock is off. We're down to seconds here left in the first quarter. That's the fourth team foul against the Panthers here. Rashid Dupree. That's his first team third. Four, three, two. That one sailed right on the bench. Kim. Kim Panther position. Panthers get it with 1.8 left. They can throw it long and someone can shoot it up. Let it bounce from almost half. Pretty almost had a chance to get it in. The defending class Second quarter about to get going into Barnes Town here, which is the Class A Boys Final, the DCSAA here on the Dinosaur Network. And uh, Kip right now again. They've been red hot since December. And they're trying to defend the Class A Championship here, this model school. Like to spread you out, kind of getting the spots and shoot. But they also play good defense here. Kemp has not been able to do everything they want to do offensively, but I tell you, boy, the con. Williams done a little bit of everything shooting wise here. But Kemp, that's a pick there. Oh, again. That one's going back. Couple of outlet passes here has not went the way of Milo. Again, if you're watching this game, please use the CC button here on YouTube. This is from the Mount School. They're watching as well. Thank you so much for checking us out here on DSN. Inside! What a tough shot! Pinder! Got it to go! He cuts the lead to five here. Kemp has been able to run tempo in this game, but let's see. Side. Oh, off the glass and in. Jackson. Takes him off on the second move there. Bounce pass. Looking to pass it and do. Jumper. Got it. Deans again. Coast to coast. Oh, Dupree puts it down. As I say, that was fun. 22 15. That's a three. Off oh, the back of it. Here, here comes the Panthers again. Coast to coast. With both of them. 
And a lead to nine for the defending champion Panthers. Offensive foul <laughs> against Mono. Five forty nine left in this first half. It has been Kemp's pace, they said earlier. Keep their opponents down the pitch and they like to run the pace. That's a three. Oh, that's been out there for McLean. Close at the top. Not the numbers there for Mono. They cost them. That's a turnover. Back inside. Looking to bounce a travel. The ball going back to uh, the Miles School here. 520 left in the half. Lead to nine. Up. Double back over. Three ball for Mains. That hits off the back, no good. The positioning was good there. And then a foul is called. I see the models. Second round. I mean that first team foul. That was the second you know, offensive foul call up on this end of the court a couple possessions ago. Dupree. Swings it back. Dash the three. Spins out again. Looking to take his, oh, what a steal by Dupree. What a steal. Numbers three on three here for the Panthers. And Dupree to the basket. Dupree. Again, with the jumper there that time. Inside, got it to go in. Shot to a bucket there. <laughs> Model school don't want to let the caboose. One down, 22nd Street here. Jumper, got it. Three has dropped the last four field goals in here for Kemp. They're rolling another steal. Four on two fast break. Dupree for three. Hits it. Field goals. 31 17 lead for the defending Class A champions. Doing it all right now. Inside, smacked away by Williams. Coming a defensive presence in the second. And a reach in. Foul on the floor. Yep, that's correct. Foul. 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 I tell you, the offense right now, the Panthers is rolling here. And they're able to turn up the tempo. Time out here by uh, MSSD. Uh, and it's a wise one there by the coach's staff. That's a 30 second time out. Hey, man, you can follow the DCSAA on Facebook and Twitter, as well as Instagram, for results and stories from all around the district. Be connected. Stay connected. Coming up with the social media sites of the DCSAA. The Class A matchup. We will have that for you coming up. Gonzaga and Wilson. Well, if you're down in this area, and you're around the area, you know that rivalry means a lot. Between those two. Wilson, by the way, trying to rebound from losing and buzzer beater fashion to sit well friends last year in the championship game over at the uh, Sports Entertainment Center at the nation's capital. Up beside here, almost at uh, Columbia Heights. Yeah, and a costume. Game, what a game that was last like. year. Oh, like that. Capital Hoops there, man. Lost nine of them. Catching that one. What a moment. What a moment indeed. We'll have both of them for you after this one. Again, Kemp right now is running pace very well. They want, oh, Dupree! Fakes the three. 
He's trying to pass it, then it got tapped out of bounds. One more second in the second. 330 left here on the game clock in the first half. Foul starting foul in. Happens on Sunday. Relax. Sleep in a little bit. And that is a foul on the floor. Eagles no, he stepped out. It's going back the other way. Back to the Eagles. Seventeen lead. Back on the deck is Dupree. He has just dropped bombs here in the second quarter. Inside. Oh, the tip did not go. That roll did not go in there. Here comes the mile score. They need to put some points up there. Inside. Look for the cut. They went for the three instead. And that was the right response. He's the senior. Drops. Oh, the prey. Back the other way. But the angle was just a bit outside. Back. Over. That's a walk. 231 left. Kick possession. Get some first half stats here for you. Back on the floor for kick number four. Nate one. Brooks. Friends up. Use possession here defensively for the Miles rule. Front end miss, offensive rebound. The fire off it. The miss, no good. Back three. Woo, mama. Putting it down again. What a three. And a walk. Turnover. Panthers possession. Forced to travel. 14 point lead here. Coming in bunches here for Kemp. They're up 17 now. Turnover again. For the steal. to stay with the model school. Needed that one to go down. Inside. Missed it high. Stepped out. Jackson right on them. Trying to get that rebound. Two. 
Chopper. Zachary Lucas. Hands and back, shot clock ain't clock, about a four second difference between the two. Back. Jumper for three. Woo, my. Cynthia Jackson. Jackson, what a first half for the Kip Mapper. Foul is called, two shots. Should be a coming here. It was in the act of shooting, each team only has six fouls combined, now making seven. Combined. What a first half of pace here for Kemp. They have just, I mean, they have just rolled. Fellow Kemp number 23, Deshaun Gray is first. Front and miss. Second shot here. That one, no good either. No good. So that's the half. Defending champion, top seed, Kip Pampers, up by 20 here over Motto. See if Motto can make a run in the second half to get themselves back in it. PWG will tell you what they're about, and then the second half of this Class A boys. Second half I begin, model will get the ball down 20 right now and try to get themselves back in this game. They're leading score. Jeremiah Deans with seven and three for four from the field. Buckets with six. Over Kemp, they got three guys in double figures, Mike. Rashad Dupree leads that category of 14. Jackson and Williams both have 10. Here for the Panthers. Open three. No good. Offensive rebound. Blocked away. Oh, what a save. I think he got it in time. The Panthers get it back. Panthers, three. Dodge dominated the first one. Second half brings him. Dupree inside, up and in. McClain with eight now. It's a 22 point lead. If double the score up on model. Like I said, Kemp has been rolling here since December. And you see why, ladies and gentlemen. Inside, had to pass it back. Shot clock winding down to 10. Got to do something with it. Foot three. Oh, that's no good at all. Turnover. Back. Other way. 
Weddle drives to the hoop. Weddle with his first two. Pick City. It comes. Dean's with the two. Dean's got that one there. That's his ninth point. And that cuts the lead to 18. Right now, if you're a model, you can't trade buckets here with Chip. You gotta take the lead. Take the lead, but you gotta get back in this one. Can take the lead. That's a three! Oh, oh man, the lid was on the bucket there for Williams. That went in and out. Back the other way. Drive. Layup goes! Zachary Memphis with eight. So again, model trying to chop into this lead here. Get it down to 10. That's what you like to be. Get into the fourth quarter and then go from there. McLean back to Dupree. Holly! The defense closed out so the hoop wouldn't happen. Layup goes in there for Williams. Williams with two in the second half. Three field goals that is. He's got 14. That was on the line. The Eagles will keep it on their end. No team fouls yet here in the second half. On four for Number nice. Got word. We're going to mention it later. But congratulations to the St. Francis Panthers. You see highlights of their win against Mount St. Joe's. The Rockstar Network this week. Oh, look out. Can I handle that one? St. Francis did the 10th BCL Championship. The third in a row. Let's see. Game out St. Joe's team. But Ace is not going to let them lose today. And that's a three. No good off the bat. Back over. That's the three. Bang. Manning off the bench gets on the scoreboard. He gives the Panthers a 21 point lead. Almost picked the pocket. That was wild, and that was a turn. Dupree. He traveled. He traveled. Eagles. Ball back to uh, the Eagles here. 4.43 left here in the third. Oh, man. And it was a walk. On the floor. Last double game finals to come here. Our nation's captain. Losing the high design. Wilson. Friends in St. John's and our girls match up to set it up. Oh, two good games we were expecting to see there. Drive. Dupree. Nice pass. Offensive foul. So Jackson was not in control. Ball back. Offensive foul. Player control personal on hit number five. Jackson. Is Over the other, whoa, whoa. Just Turn outside, as they say. Kick Panther possession. So baseball season's upon us. George Washington, home in the Atlantic 10. And so, that's where we set things up here. Right in two. Inside, swings it, drive to the center lane. Oh, what a move there by Jackson. Jackson, 12. Three-headed Panther Beast rolling here. Dips it, that's a three. Oh, spin down. And now, rebound there to Jackson. Support. Inside, cut it. And one. 
Williams turning it up now in the second half. Really. Zachary Bennett, the second team first. At the line, shooting number 11, Dave Wong. Willie, shooting Wong. Shooting. Missed it. And the rebound over the model. Drive inside. Foul is called, and that's Dean's again. He's come back to the line to shoot two. Foul kick number four, Nick Wong Brooks. His second. At the line to shoot number 13, Jeremiah Dean. Front end mess on the first. On the floor for the Eagles, number one, what deal with Dina? Dina back in the game. Second shot here for Deans. Missed that. And high shot it on Jackson. And it's going to stay with the Eagles on their end. Eagles basketball. No good. Nice rebound, but then it slipped away, and again, it stays here on the Eagles end. They say living like dangerous. Time out by model. That's a cool time out for the Eagles. Then. NBC Sports Washington broadcast regional coverage of sports events throughout the mid Atlantic United States with a focus on professional sports teams and high school sports teams. Thanks to Baltimore, Washington, as well as sports news and entertainment programming. Visit NBCSports.com slash Washington. In here, model again trying to claw their way back in this game. Time is going to start being the enemy pretty soon here. Shot clock down to 12. A lot of pass work. Nothing advancing to the basket. Shot clock down to six. Pull up. Tip and miss. A lot of dribbling and passing there for Milo, and they weren't able to get it to the basket until then. Oh, that's another three. No good there for Manny. May Auburn could have got a foul call there, but it did not happen on that exchange. The best back. That's a three. No good. Up the court, Manning could not get it in time. Eagles, Back to the Eagles. On their end. Yeah. 
Jones. The ball back to my possession equal. On the score for Kip, number zero, Albert Henderson. Also returning number one, Charles McClain. Try to pick and roll. They turned it over. That comes the Panthers. Layup. No, that's a foul. Ooh, that was that was close. A little close. Three. No good. Offensive rebound there to Medina. Again, travel. Travel. Set them feet. Got Travel. Kick after possession. Kick after possession. Kick after possession. left. Here in the third. Dish, three, no good. Trying not to lose it there, was Waddle. Fakes it, gotta shoot it, front end miss. Front end of Brooks. Inside the dish, Bush didn't go up strong with it. Final gets it back. Oh, walk. Gotta do a quick pass there, and that was not it. Kip DC possession. Kip DC gets it back. I scored much in this third, but done enough to make sure the opposition had not. Offensive foul. Jackson. The model's only scored six points in the quarter. Kip has scored 13. It don't feel like it, but they have. Not now what we got? What we got here? What we got here? Now they're going to redo it again. DCSA Class A final. And then the double A coming up here on the girls' side first. Sit well against St. John. The tease is the third week in in a row getting St. John's girls. And I ain't mad about it. It's been a good treat for me. I see this as Bud is always a good treat. We get to see the top seed as well. That one tipped and missed. They got time here. Three, two, one. He was traveled. Two tenths of a second left here in the field. Will you blank? That's going to be the end. Got to do it. After three, 
The Panthers up big by 27. They're looking at pretty decent. I mean, they're acting as well as they're doing so. We'll find out if they can. Fourth quarter here coming up here on DSC. Fourth quarter here underway to Mars out here with you. The Kent Panthers right now in control of this one. They're looking to repeat as the Class A champions in the DCSA. Yeah, a little less than eight minutes of doing so. That's a three. Good night, Irene. Six, one, point game. fighting still in this one, but that lead is optimal now. Floater no good, offensive rebound. And Baker at the line to shoot two. Fourth team foul here against uh, yep. First shot. In there. We do have the Alhammer schedule. We're going to talk about that during the Gonzaga matchup. And they will be taking on Melvin Pratt from Pennsylvania. What a sequence there. A couple different teams, some that we haven't seen in recent years, from the regions anyway. Try to mix it up a little bit. Bad it, almost turned over. St. Stephen St. Agnes, runner up. Yes, they have a few Hey. Division one will be the first non-Catholic school to be a part of the home. Weddle kept his dribble off the foot. It's gonna stay with my 689 left in this one. Mr. Walsh for taping, not sure the result, they can make it out. That's a three that hits. Walshner with the deep three. That cuts into that lead. Somewhat. Um, I was saying if Walsh is in it, in the Maryland private school semi, reversal goes by Another school that's a part of the act. Turnover. Okay. 13 foul against the uh, model. Six oh four left in this one. They've been red hot since December. Show why again today. This is it for them, I do believe, in their season. Outside of uh, Gonzaga, the L season will be done here today, regardless of their results. Bannett, out of bounds, he's with the Panthers, 27 on the shot clock. 6 1 left in the game. Inside, got it to go with Jackson. Simeon Jackson. Say a meek, 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 that's all, folks. 30 point lead, all on the scale. Jackson's alone. And a foul. Ooh, 
wipe out there. Dominic Eagles number two, Joshua Watson, Texas first. Team four. Team four. Fourteen fouls each. And the line shooting number five, Sadie Jackson. Shooting two. Two shot foul. First shot. Two-point lead. And the score has doubled up here on model. And another turnover. Timeout. Timeout. Timeout by Mono. Timeout. Last timeout. That's a 30-second timeout. Quick 30 second. St. Charles and Oxen Hill on the MPSSA side. What a game that's going to be. St. Charles defending South Maryland champions. Just won it last week. And Oxen Hill winning the BG County Championship from the 3A, 2A, 1A of BG. And they both meet each other in the regional semifinals. You can believe that one. Merville Delaney back up in Baltimore area, in Baltimore County. That's going to be a two. A couple matchups to look forward to in the uh, regional semifinals. And hopefully, on our end, we'll be doing an MPSSA quarterfinal matchup here next week on the Dice Swing Network. And then we'll be coming at you from the University of Maryland and Towson, especially with the boys and girls. MPSSA semifinals and the boys' final. Long pass up the court and a charge offensive foul. Clear control person on offensive foul on catch number four. Make one gross. Got ourselves. We have a running clock here. Over 30. That's how that works. Shot clock. Uh, Nine on. Clock will stop at 4:20. See what time we put back up on there. 4:27. Clock should be down to maybe 27. I'm gonna keep it at, I'm gonna keep it at 30. Tap, right near the scores table. Ball back to Miles still. That's a three. Bang on, no good. Out of bounds. Which way it's gonna go, look like Miles will keep it. Oh, the Panthers will get it back. Four guys in the back. Dupree got away. Just back to Brooks. Foul is caught. It's going to be the 15th foul in this model. We do have a running clock. They're going to put the backups in. Class A championship here for Kip. I'm going to back up in there. First a rebound, three ball, that tipped and missed. That long arm's got that one. Back. And a 
Turnover. Carrying the basketball. Eagles Eagles get it back. On the clock now. Thirty point lead. Rock is gonna run. Don't as well as should here. Model just Five today that uh, the Panther team has come in with. I tell you, they have come with some five five. Turn over. Inside. Shooting two. 16 foul against Model here. Two minutes left. Remembers what happened to them a year ago here, not here, but down at the Sports Entertainment Center. They was defeated at the buzzer by Sidwell Friends Boys. A bump, a foul. Should be the one-on-one -on -one here. Seconds will continue to run. One-on-one, 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 one-on-one. One Coming in for the Eagles, number one, Dr. Mixing in, the one-on-one one is in effect. One-up trophy, and on his way out. Gets the first, that's the good. Take the time to shoot the second. I wouldn't shoot that thing until three seconds left in the game. Second shot. Rattles out. Offensive rebound. It hit the chalk. Model gets it back. And that was good. The Panthers repeat. This play is a champion. They went 65 32. Model had a stick around band for just too much for him. Ladies and gentlemen, your attention. If anyone located a teal iPhone right lost here. in the bedroom, if anyone has located a teal iPhone, right here in the center. please text the following number. We still got some time. 2400 That's 2400-4917. Ready to 
celebrate his gift for a second season in a row. Say the model props to him. a win right there over in the south. But, uh, our school just came up a little short in this one. in the second half. And now, and ladies and gentlemen, let's meet the 2019, 2020 Boys Class A DCSAA Champion, Jeff DC Panthers. Panthers won the PCSAA Championship last week, and they repeat as Class A champions in the DCSAA for a second season in a row. It's time to favorite, and they win at 31 and 4 will be their final record this season. Always fun to see that banner go. Take it back to your, your gym. In the suburbs of the nation's capital. Repeat as Class A champions for a second straight season. So the Class A side is done. You know, Acosta and Kip DC, they've won in the girls and boys respectively. Who's going to do it in the double A, the girls and boys respectively? We get the girls' answers coming up. Top two C's, Sitwell Friends, St. John's College. They meet it in this one. We'll be back in a half an hour for that. Till then, so long for now.
missed the three. Price with a athletic offensive rebound. Puts it back up and hits! My goodness, Marvin Price. Putting on a show. Harassing. Ten. Nine. Eight. Quickly has it. Seven. Six. Quickly for three. That's it! This is Guy Sporting Network.